Here are terrifying things science still can't explain. Number 5. The Immortal Jellyfish Deep in the ocean lives a tiny creature that laughs in the face of death. Turritopsis dorni, better known as the Immortal Jellyfish, doesn't just heal or regenerate. When threatened, injured, or starving, it literally reverses its own aging. It transforms back into its juvenile form like rewinding life itself. It's not reincarnation, it's biological time travel. This jellyfish could, in theory, live forever, dying only if something eats it first. Scientists have been studying this loop for decades and still can't explain how its cells reset without breaking down or mutating. If humans could do this, disease, aging, even death itself would become optional. Yet somehow, a creature smaller than your thumbnail has cracked immortality and doesn't even know it. Number 4. The Mandela Effect You clearly remember it. Looney Tunes, right? Except, it's Looney Tunes. With a U. Millions swear it used to be spelled differently, and yet every logo, every archive, every trace says otherwise. That's the Mandela Effect, when massive groups of people share the same false memory. Some remember Febrez with two E's. Others insist Pikachu had a black tip on his tail. Science says it's confabulation, our brains rewriting memories to make stories fit. But others suspect something stranger, glitches in reality, merged timelines, or collective slips between universes. Because how can so many people be wrong in the exact same way? Whether it's neuroscience or the multiverse, one thing's clear. Memory isn't proof. It's persuasion. And sometimes the past itself might not be as stable as we think. Number 3. Foreign Accent Syndrome Imagine waking up from a head injury and suddenly sounding like you're from another country. You're American, but now you speak with a flawless British accent. Or you've never left Ohio, but you suddenly roll your R's like you grew up in Rome. That's foreign accent syndrome, a real documented condition where trauma, stroke, or even migraines cause subtle damage to the brain's speech centers. The person's vocal cords don't change. Their neurology does. The brain rewires the rhythm, tone, and emphasis of speech, and somehow the result mimics accents they've never heard closely enough to imitate. Only a few dozen confirmed cases exist, and everyone baffles doctors. The voice changes overnight, but personality, memory, and native language stay the same. Science can map the brain, but not why it sometimes decides to rebrand you, complete with a brand new accent. Number 2. The Voynich Manuscript It's been called the most mysterious book on Earth. 240 pages of unknown language, strange symbols, and drawings of plants that don't exist anywhere. Discovered in the early 1900s, the Voynich Manuscript has been carbon dated to the 1400s, but no one knows who wrote it or why. Every codebreaker, linguist, and AI that's tried to decipher it has failed. The writing doesn't match any known alphabet, and the structure obeys grammar rules of a language that doesn't exist. Some pages look like medical diagrams, others like star maps, as if written for a civilization that never was. Theories range from secret alchemy to alien communication to a medieval prank gone too far. But after centuries of analysis, one thing's still certain. The Voynich manuscript was written by someone who understood language and didn't want to be understood back. Quick pause before the final one. What's a mystery that still keeps you up at night? Comment your theory below. And if the unknown fascinates you as much as it freaks you out, hit subscribe before you forget. Number 1. Cosmic Fine Tuning The universe shouldn't exist, at least not like this. If gravity were a fraction weaker, galaxies would never have formed, a fraction stronger, and everything would have collapsed in seconds. Even the tiniest tweak in the mass of a proton or the charge of an electron, and life, stars, chemistry, all of it disappears. Scientists call this the fine-tuning problem. The laws of physics sit on a razor's edge, balanced so precisely that it feels intentional. Like someone adjusted the cosmic settings, click by click, until life became possible. Some call it coincidence. Others say it's proof of a multiverse. Billions of universes, each with different settings, and we just happen to be in the lucky one. But whichever you believe, the math is chilling. Out of infinite possibilities, we exist inside the one that works. Which raises the question, was it luck or design?